Hey kids, it's me, Tony. It's Sunday night, and I am slowly getting ready for the weekend. So I'm sitting here in my bedroom, in my recliner, and I'm enjoying a cup of tea. Now, this is an unusual cup of tea, so I thought I would tell you about it. I got this tea from a company called Welltopia that asked me to try it. You might wonder what type of tea is this? Well, who knew they make a menopause support tea? It's for those of us who are of a certain age, who have um, gone through, are going through, getting ready to go through. Uh, the change always oh, makes it sound, you know, like Transformers. Um, so, I have been trying this the last couple of weeks. It is an herbal tea. It helps to protect your heart, increase estrogen, enhance your mood, and decrease hot flashes. This is full of different um, natural ingredients. So this is maybe if you're one of these people don't really want to do the hormone replacement and you want a little help of uh, more natural type than that. Let me tell you what's in here. There is cinnamon, which helps protect your heart. There is a loot hero root, which helps with night sweats. We all know how fun those are. There is red clover that helps decrease hot flashes. Or as I had a boss tell me once, personal summers. Ginkgo leaf to enhance your mood. Licorice root to help to decrease the hot flashes and increase estrogen. Peach flavor to balance, um, and I'll talk about this in a bit, kind of the taste of all the other stuff I just mentioned. And black cohosh, cohosh helps to increase estrogen and helps with vaginal dryness. All these things. Okay, so what it is, you take a cup a day, and they recommend... Uh, you take this for at least three weeks, and I've only taken it for a couple. Now, let me just say, if somebody hands me a tea bag and says, oh, try this tea, the first thing I do is sniff the tea bag. I don't know if you do that. That's what I do. But I want to smell it and see what it smells like. Don't sniff this tea bag. You may be different, but the smell was a little offsetting to me. Uh, it's because of all the things I just mentioned. <clears throat> I don't think, you know, they smell that great. But then there's peach in here to sort of offset those, um, those flavors. But when you just smell the tea bag, all of it together was a little overwhelming for me. Now, once you make it into a tea... It's much different. And they do recommend you might want to add some honey and some lemon to the tea. Now, I've drank it plenty without that, but I have added it in, mostly because I'm coming down with a bit of bronchitis, I think. So it was like, I'm going to kill you know, two birds at once. So let me show you the tea bag. It's been in here, but it's a very plain tea bag. Oh, it's dripping. So there's no little string. So you boil your water, you put the little tea bag in, you let it set, you add your honey or your lemon or both or neither, and then you drink it up. And I like it. I like it a little bit of honey and a little bit of lemon. Kind of balances everything out. And it tastes 
It just tastes like an herbal tea. And um, I've enjoyed it. Now, what has this done for me? Well, you know, like I said, they said it's best to try this for about three weeks. I've only been doing it for two. This is not something you're going to take and, you know, in an hour, you're going to feel like a 25-year-old. You're not. It's not going to make a difference overnight. But over time, I think especially, um, I think the part I've noticed the most is sleeping at night and not getting uh, night sweats, which I don't get as bad as I used to. But I still um, get them, you know, fairly easy to kind of overheat. And I've noticed that that's backed off a little bit. And, you know, um, as far as my mood, I think my mood is usually all right. So I'm past the worst of menopause, so I don't have as strong uh, symptoms as I did. But... This is like a nice insurance policy and something doesn't creep back because really, truly, every once in a while, even though the factory is shut down, I think somebody tries to crank it up every once in a while and I just kind of get a little of, of all the symptoms I had. So this has helped prevent that. You know, I think anytime you can increase estrogen naturally that's a good thing and um, overall I've been happy with it just don't sniff the tea bag that's it so this is out of Houston I will put the link below if you're interested in trying this I mean it's all natural it's all natural I mean there's not really side effects so if you're not really wanting to go through the um, old school, take all these pills because you're going through menopause, take all this uh, hormonal replacement therapy because you're going through menopause and you want to do something different. This is a great alternative. So, again, it's called Welltopia Menopause Support Tea. And it's actually good. As long as you don't sniff the tea bag. You know what you're going to do when you buy this? You know what the first thing you're going to do? Is you're going to sniff that tea bag. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you're going to go, oh, but make the tea. The tea is fine. The tea is good. It's like having any herbal tea. Anyway, that's it. I wanted to tell you about it. Like I said, I'll have a link uh, below. And um, just look check them out. I'm all for natural companies. It's manufactured by the Wishful Company Limited out of Houston. So, it's a nice Texas brand as well. Anyway, that's it. I'm going to finish my tea. And then, I look forward to a brand new week. Oh, boy. Okay, talk to you kids later. Bye.